and the bottoms were too. <laughs> Just a little too comfortable. And it would be fine if you were allowed to return, but you can't return anything during this quarantine. Good afternoon. I want to say this is the first time that I picked up the camera today. We had a very busy, whoops, sorry, I'm trying to do something with these tongs. We had a very busy morning and then a pretty busy afternoon because, well, I think I hit diploma, to, diploma today, so that was exciting. So we did that. And then, um, and you know, that was different because of the whole quarantine situation. So we did that and it was amazing. And then we dropped the kids off and we went to go get Arlo's oil change. And then this crazy freak storm happened. Let me pause the fries. Hold on. So then this crazy freak storm happened, which was fucking Hold on, you gotta be careful when you watch this. If you watch this, because it's got jalapeno juice all over it. Okay. Um, crazy, crazy freak storm. And it like knocked down a ton of like trees and stuff in the area. Like we passed by the new house and there was this big piece, big piece of tree like on the front lawn. We were like, what the hell? So that's that. So we moved it down to the, like the bottom of the curb by, well, the end of the curb there. So hopefully somebody can pass by and take it like the city anyway so that's what's happening i'm in the middle of cooking let me show you what i'm doing arlo's making, green sauce. Arlo's making our green sauce hold on let me just show you oh there it is it's inside okay there it is she's about to mix it up it's going to be loud in about a minute okay so i am grilling up some chicken breasts you guys know we like to make sandwiches out of this like this being the bread so i just got some chicken breast grilling up on our this is the rock pan r-o-c-k and this is just seasoned with a little salt and pepper nothing really you know crazy and then i've got some noodles cooking for the kids there's also some potatoes carrots and some chicken and then we're having a chicken caesar salad and we're going to have some pork chops with it so there's a lot going on over here a whole lot so what we have is a uh, chicken Caesar salad. I don't know if you can see, but there's like there a is piece some of, chicken in there. I swear. There is some chicken. Uh huh. And then the dressing, we use this Ken's creamy Caesar. I made some uh, green sauce earlier, as you can see. I think Dana told you. Mm -hmm. And then we have some pork chops. And then I think she's gonna put some of those salad toppers. And she's got some Lacroix. See. And then I've got ooh a Diet Coke over there. Good Thursday morning happy june 4th arlo is actually putting up a instagram coffee story so i believe she picked tennessee whiskey as the song son's walking backwards because she thinks i'm gonna fucking record her in her on boxer no in her boxers um i wasn't gonna say underwear i was gonna say something else but in my knickers yeah, that's what I was trying to figure out what to say. Yeah, that was. Uh, so we have an appointment today. I'm not sure at the time, but it's supposed to be between 10 and... I don't know. That's a whole hour. I don't know. I guess we'll go there around 10 yeah. and wait the hour. Um, To the new house. Somebody's coming to, like, estimate how much... It's going to cost us for, uh, you know, like to do a once over clean up in the, in the yard, in the wherever on the grounds. So we'll do that. And then, um, we're going to have chicken jalapeno popper chicken salad, which I'm going to make, I'm making it with canned tuna. I'm, it comes out good with canned tuna. Canned chicken. Tuna, chicken.
canned chicken. Um, I don't think I've made it on the vlog here, so I'll show you guys kind of like what I put in it. It's real simple. And we eat it with raw cabbage leaves. And it's real good. The crunch is delicious. It would help if I actually had a cup to pour my coffee into. Yeah, unless you were going to sip it out of the yeah. carafe. Oh, you got the word. Mm -hmm. Anywho, keep it up. I'm going to show you in your skivvies. And then I'll show you in yours. I don't have them on. I have shorts on. If only on. they could have seen how much time. Oh, I know. Did I, did, I, did, I t did I tell you guys what happened? So I bought two pajama sets at Walmart last week. They were cheap. They were $9.97. You get obviously two pieces for 10 bucks. They're exactly what I like to wear to bed. They were super soft. They had that like real soft material that I like my leggings. Like my leggings have that real soft velvety material. They were like this type of um, sleeveless like string. It was great. I got an extra large because I didn't want to get a large. I wanted to be comfortable in bed and have a lot of room to move around. So the first night I wore the pink ones and it was a dream. I actually wore them for two nights because I couldn't take them off. They were so comfortable. Second night I bought like a blue floral, like a navy blue floral with pink flowers. And the top was so comfortable. And the bottoms were too. Just a little too comfortable that they were a 3x the bottoms and the top was an extra large because some asshole switched them and now i'm stuck with a 3x bottom because they're not accepting returns so yeah don't know what to do with that what did one of our instagram friends say someone out there is walking around yes with a 3x top and an extra large bottom <laughs> can you imagine it spongebob anyway oh yes <laughs> Anyway, like that's so annoying and it would be fine if you were allowed to return But you can't return anything during this quarantine because they don't want the shit that you brought to your house coming back to the store So I'm stuck with these uh, maybe I'll make a comforter set who knows Jalapeno popper chicken salad, okay, Dana added some tomatoes. We've never had it that way before um, You see some cheese some of the uh, bacon crumbles jalapenos and then I gotta put them in cabbage leaves. Hold on. Okay, just like that. So I put some of that chicken salad inside the cabbage leaves and then you kinda just roll it up and you stuff it in your mouth. Kinda like that. Good afternoon, happy Friday. It is the 6th of June, right? Three, four, five, fifth of June. Today's the 5th of June. Um, so, in, let me show you what I'm doing. It's, uh, what time is it? 3.08. In here, I've got a uh, pork shoulder, bend me, with, um, we're gonna have that with some roasted veggies tonight. I'm actually gonna have some spaghetti squash with mine. Arlo's probably gonna have some green beans or maybe some broccoli. I'm not sure yet, whatever she chooses. Um, so that's what's happening. We got a couple of things from BJ's. We got a shit ton of drinks because it's hot. The kids need drinks. We needed drinks. Um, we got another one of these, which we love. These tomatoes. Um, what else? Oh, we got a pineapple for the kids. I'm actually going to, whoops, I'm going to cut this up right now. And... I got some spaghetti and don't mind my hair, but I don't know what to do with it anymore. But let me show you. I got three big things of spaghetti squash, which I'm very, very excited for. I'm actually going to make one of them right now and put it in there with the pork and just let it cook. And then I'll scrape it, put it in a container and I'll have that for the weekend. This way I'm actually going to make Arlo's dinner tonight too, because she'll probably have this pork tomorrow for dinner with green beans or broccoli, whatever she chooses. Anywho. That's what's happening. Our friend Nicole sent us uh, some sprinkles from her company, the Sprinkle Company. If you guys want to check it out, these are sugar-free sprinkles. She sent us a bunch and some pride sprinkles, which, oh, that's so exciting. Arlo, after she's done helping Austin, she's going to make a base for ice cream. And we, we are going to have... Some homemade ice cream tonight. Nicole also sent us 
She sells these. This is peanut butter frosting mix, Sprinkle Company, like I said, if you're interested. I'm gonna try to remember to link it down below. If not, just look up Sprinkle Company. So this is two peanut butter frostings. I'm very excited to have that. Anywho, so I'm gonna get started in what I'm doing. The kids are gonna have what they ate last night. Austin had steak, um, some potato and carrot that I made like two days ago. I roasted them in the oven with some olive oil, salt, pepper, garlic powder, onion powder. Onion powder. So he's gonna have that with some steak. Sammy's gonna have a better than cheddar. She doesn't want no potatoes. And then I'm gonna make a little bit of butter noodles for the kids. And that's what's happening. Let me, uh, let me cut this pineapple. I might put you on the counter to watch. Close my eyes and pretend that I'm not here. All these empty faces talking about problems I don't care. I can't wait till sundown because my body's aching. I just want to dance. I just want to dance. Don't you want to party? Standing in the crowd feeling your heartbeat. Everybody's carefree. Everybody's carefree. Don't you want to party? Standing in the crowd feeling your heartbeat. Don't you want to party? Don't you want to party? Okay, so we sat outside, I don't know, this hair, I can't stand it. We sat outside for like an hour, and while the pork was still cooking, but now we are at the table and we're gonna eat. Let me show you what we've got. We've got spaghetti squash in here, some mozzarella, well, we're making a caprese salad, so mozzarella, uh, basil, and then we've got little grape tomatoes. This is the pernell. And then in here, I just got some ice because I'm going to be having some LaCroix. And I think that's it, right? Arlo's got like a reduction somewhere. I'm not sure where it is. Oh, here it is. So that's a balsamic reduction. So that's what we are having for dinner tonight. Oh, and we forgot the green sauce mm -hmm. that we're going to be dipping that in into. Okay, so we just watched two episodes of 13 reasons why I made it through two of them ish I was tired I w it was like I was on and off I was on, I was tired but I, I have a I had I kind of know what's going on so I'm not gonna rewatch them but so far so good I hate that they start off so slow and then they get somewhere but I mean what are they gonna get right to it you know they gotta get you gotta get your attention Anyway, so we're going to bed. Toodles. Toodles? Night.